The Impossible World Yesterday, I was listening to Gary V here on YouTube and I heard him saying, you always see what you're looking for. This statement resonates so much with me because I grew up from one of the most negative society you can ever imagine. I'm an African and if you're an American or European watching this video, I'm sorry, there are no words for me to describe the kind of society where I grew up. You just can't understand. I mean, a world where almost everyone I knew believed that they were in hellfire. The world where the media never writes or say any positive thing about. The world where nobody in your family will ever encourage you to do anything extraordinary. But in this very world, I decided to look for the possibility of building a company, even though I had no money. I learned about negotiation. I read about humans and the way their brains work. I read tons of books about business, life and how people rose from zero to hundred. As I read, I took actions. As I took actions, I made mistakes and failed. The more I acted, the more I got feedback in form of mistakes and the better I became. Napoleon Hill said, there are too many resources in the world for those who know how to get it and I can tell you that that's true. At a point in my entrepreneurial life. I had to reject someone who wanted to invest in my business because I already had more than enough money from someone else. But again, someone will watch this video and say, well, that's not possible in my country. Well, you will always see what you look for. Whatever you believe is possible is what you will learn how to achieve. If I don't believe that it's possible to build a company without money, I wouldn't wake up every day to learn how to achieve it. If you think it's not possible to get all the resources you need to start a business from others, I respect your opinion and wish you good luck.